Good morning. Welcome back to the Devore Wild Fam. I am just enjoying some coffee. It's about 7.30 here in California, but I'm still on Idaho time. So I've been up already for about an hour. My mom and her boyfriend are still asleep, so I thought I would get up. I made myself a cup of coffee. I'm gonna do some writing, some journaling, um, and then I guess I'll get ready for the day. Um, if you guys aren't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe. We are a fun family of eight who live in Idaho Falls, but if you're new here, I am in Southern California with no kids and no husband visiting my family. I really need a little desk like this. My mom says she got it for about, I think she said $60, $80 at Target, but I really need a little workspace like this. Something like this would fit perfect under my window in my bedroom because we have the desk in our living room but Adam's kind of taken over that. It's all his work stuff, his computer. It's just, you know, yeah. So I would like to have my own little space like this. I think something like this for me would be perfect because then I could work on my writing. I could put my laptop because my laptop just sits on my dresser. So I'm going to look into this when we get home. Might even be able to find something at the thrift store. Never thought about getting myself a little desk. It's always been about Adam and the kids, but... I think it's time to start thinking about something that I might need. My aunt sent me to my mom's with all these earrings and she has told me to pick out whatever pairs I want. So I've already gotten these in a bag. And so far I'm like, I can't find the pair to this one. It's got a little pearl in it, but I mean, look at how cute these are. She said to pick whatever I want. This doesn't take me a while. There's a ton of earrings. But I love, love, love me some earrings. So my mom's throwing a party, a birthday, an early birthday party for me and my nephew, Lauren. He's not here yet. There's Maya, my nephew's wife, my sister. And your niece now. My new niece, yes. <laughs> So we even have a cake. I told her I eat. Oh look at they tomorrow. spelled my name wrong. I just showed you. I told her I eat. I know I heard you. I was telling the vlog. Oh. <laughs> That's okay. Becky's supposed to be I E and my nephew's Lauren. We got some cupcakes. There's my hey, oldest yeah. nephew. Hey. <laughs> so my sister and my brother in law and family got me a gift for my birthday. Oh, cool. Look at this, you guys. Because we're going to be starting our garden really soon, as soon as it stops snowing. Awesome. Thank you. They also gave me a gift card and some seeds to start my garden. My, my great niece, Skylar, drew me a beautiful picture. Actually, she drew me two pictures. We're about to do the cake for me and my nephew. So... I gotta Sarah, hand this. Who wants Sarah, to vlog? Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> Here's my cake and ice cream. It's my nephew Preston. Jameson giving me hugs because they're leaving. Hayden. Bye. I love you too. Aww. I love you too. So I'm just sitting at my mom's having some coffee with her. I won't put her in the video because she has not done her makeup. I need to comb my hair. My niece. And her husband are coming in a couple hours to pick me up and we're gonna head up to Lake Arrowhead where my dad lives and I will spend the day with him and his wife and tomorrow I leave for back home. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, mom, I'm leaving. I'll Yay! see you at, I'll see you at Easter. Daddy. Okay, do my cats do what? Do your cats do that weird facial 
and show her the face when they smells a new scent. Vlog. Paparazzi, go away. <laughs> it's, it's for the vlog. Oh, hi vlog. <laughs> hi, love you. So we're on our way to my dad's house up in the mountains. I was gonna vlog you guys and I forgot, but we're almost to Lake Arrowhead. They're getting ready to move, so it's kind of empty, but this is their beautiful house up on the lake for probably another month. <laughs> Every morning we wake up with a bird sanctuary and we have squirrels fighting over it. It's so much fun. We feel like, like we're in an Look at these views. Actually, when I flew over from Salt Lake City, you could see Lake Arrowhead, and this is Lake Arrowhead and Big Bear on the other side flying in to Ontario. Do the whole house. Maybe somebody in Idaho wants to buy this joint. Okay. <laughs> Hello, how are you? How you doing? Okay guys, we're going to a malt shop. We're gonna go get a hamburger. I'm gonna gain five pounds. <laughs> Probably me too. <laughs> Malt shop. This is really cool. 1946 it opened, and all the all the hamburgers are named after cars. My kids have been here, and they always talk about it. So my dad's taking me, and Karen's taking me for my birthday. Look, they they brought me a birthday shake, you guys. Oh, I need to let them know. Exactly. Alrighty, I'm gonna blow my candle out. <laughs> Look at these giant hamburgers, and when my milkshake's almost gone, I've been drinking it. Long hamburger. Show them the car, John. That's cool. <laughs> Niece and her husband are leaving, so we're going to take some pictures real quick. <laughs> Here's the room I'm staying in tonight. It's got a view. And I have my own bathroom. And then this goes up to the main house. The garage. And then this is my dad's room. And they have a hot tub. And a bathroom. And then you come up these stairs. And there's like a little loft. Oh my gosh, I'm out of breath. That they use for their office. I'm kind of sad he's moving, but my dad's gonna be 75 this year and it's just getting too hard for him up here with all the shoveling up the snow and all the stairs and stuff so it's time it's so pretty up here good morning i'm leaving in a couple hours to go back to idaho but what a beautiful day it is up here on the mountain look at this i'm on a walk with my dad dangerous right there on the edge. What do you guys think? <laughs>
this hill. My dad's almost 75 and he's beating me. <laughs> I'm gonna show you the downstairs. They gave me permission to vlog in here. So this is the mother-in-law's quarters. So see, it has its own kitchen. When I used to come here with the kids all the time, and Adam, we would stay. We would stay down here. And it's got a huge master bedroom. There used to be two double bunk beds in here. And there's their view. There's three decks. It's really nice. It's super cute down here. And that's a closet. And then they have a huge living room. So it's a big house. And then the bathroom down here. So yeah, when we used to come up here for the 4th of July all the time because you just go out on the top deck upstairs and the fireworks are right over you. So we would come with all my kids and my sister's family and we would all stay down here. Me and Adam and the kids would sleep in this room and my sister and her husband would sleep in this uh, the room that I stayed in last night. That room. And then the teenagers, this pulls out, it's a mix of bed. They would all sleep in, in here. My dad made me some toast and got me Starbucks. And there's my stuff. I'm just, we're gonna head to the airport in about 10 minutes. Thank you. <clears throat> I was trying to get the Blue Jays. My dad's got the bird feeders up. I'm on my way to the airport, leaving my dad's house. Time to go home. And here we are in Southern California traffic. Fun times. I'm home. This is going to be a little bit longer vlog. <laughs> My flight to Ida or to Ontario, California, to Salt Lake was delayed like 30 minutes, and so they gave me a backup flight from Salt Lake City to Idaho Falls, which was not leaving till 10 o'clock, 10:50 at night. I wouldn't have gotten here till midnight, so they gave me that backup flight. So we landed in Salt Lake, and like I booked it. I had 10 minutes to make it to my to my original flight and I landed in Terminal A. Salt Lake City is pretty big so I had to go out find Terminal B, B25. I was running. I probably ran a quarter of a mile and the airport was packed. <laughs> then I had to take a bus. Luckily that flight was delayed about 15 minutes so I made it and I'm home. All right so I was gonna film myself like going in the door with the kids but you, you all I'm, I'm tired. <laughs> And that, that would be hard to do. So I'm just going to say chicken tendies now. Um, I had a really good trip. It was good to see my family, but I'm really glad to be home. And I'm excited to see my kids. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Want to be the person that you call up when you're down. 
Wanna be the first who knows all of your deepest secrets Can I be the one who wakes you up before you miss your ride? Cause I wanna be close to you And I wanna show you something new You gotta know Every day I got your back, yeah, you can count on me for that So put your hand in mine, I will be there every day When you're sick of the climb, I will make sure it's okay I know you didn't ask for any of this But we read for the sky, that's what flying colors now Say true to each other I will always be there for you whenever